It's time for part two of five on our Korean startup series. Today we focus on one specific startup in the food delivery business that has broken new ground via mobile technology. Our Kim ji Hyun tells us the secret behind its success. A number of apps have popped up in recent years, enabling users to order food without ever making a phone call. One of these is Pedal Minjok by a startup company called Ua Brothers, and it's getting a lot of attention. The app, launched in 2010, is known for its user friendly mobile platform. A commercial for the app, which looks like a movie trailer, went viral on social networking sites and YouTube. <laughs> Pedal Minjo currently dominates the app based food delivery sector, estimated to be worth 1 trillion Korean won or 928 million US dollars. Over 5 million deliveries were made through the app last month alone, with 150,000 restaurants participating nationwide. But what makes this company stand out is its potential, fueled by a major investment from Goldman Sachs. I think the $36 million investment from Goldman Sachs shows a level of confidence, not just in Perari Minjok, but the, Sam, the Seoul uh, startup ecosystem. Um, there's a great level of talent. There are wonderful universities here pumping out incredibly educated students. Um, there is investment coming in. And then the most important thing, there's drive and hunger to want to build. What's the secret behind getting so much attention? What, what's the secret behind your success? Sure. I think one of the best things about this company is that because of the structure that we have, anybody at any level can voice their opinion, and uh, their opinion is extremely valuable. This flat structure helps to better cater to consumer trends, with the timely execution of ideas. It also sets the company apart from most Korean firms and startups that follow a top-down structure. So what's next? It plans to broaden its takeout focus to include all types of restaurants. The company also wants to go global. It has already partnered up with Line, a mobile messaging app owned by Korea's largest portal neighbor to expand into Japan. Kim Jeon, Anirang News.